guys so as promised today I'm gonna be doing an update video on my setups and you know just pretty much how all my enclosures are put together so let's get started so as per usual here we have Lori and this is her setup right now still needing to get a hide here and then under her we still have bells His cage is looking bomb. I love it. And then what's new, down here we have my skink. And that's his setup. And then for those who saw my other video, um, here I had my leopard gecko. And then here I had my corn snake. But I put my corn snake back in here. just because I thought it was a good size for him and then this made a bigger enclosure for my my gecko I'm waiting for my excavator clay it should be coming um, tomorrow or like the day after um, and once again I'll be like I had planned for here I'm gonna put my excavator clay on like on top here so that she has walking space on top and then also on the ground and that's for her and then down here, I have my new setup for Sully. I actually found all of this in the trash, believe it or not. I was going down the street <clears throat> and I walked by this house and it said, it was like on the side of the street and it said um, that like they were giving it away so I just grabbed it obviously <clears throat> obviously not what was inside or the lamps but just the tank the wood on the top and then the desk on the bottom down here I have <clears throat> an extra 10 gallon I don't know if you guys can see that probably not but anyways in here I have a 10 gallon tank and then I have all my supplies But yeah, this is the setup now. I actually love it. This is a 40 gallon tank, so right now for Sully, it's like the perfect size. It still has plenty of space. This is the Exoterra 18 by 18 by 18. This one is an Atasuki, or I don't even know. I think it's a uh, 20 gallons. Uh, this is <clears throat> four feet long, two feet deep, something like 16 inches high or something. And then same thing for all of those. So it's really good sizes for all my adults. And yeah. So this was just my small um, update for you guys. If you guys have any suggestions on videos like care videos or tips or Q&As or anything, just comment down below. <clears throat> Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. I'll see you guys in my next video. I'm going to be trying to film as much as possible. I did get a request for a Blue Tongue Skin Care video, so that's what I'll do soon. I'll also do a feeding video, so stay tuned. <laughs>